Yo, what's up guys? Uh, apparently I cannot join the uh, BCL because I'm not a uh, qualify. Um, so this was my last match in the BCL and I tried my best but I just wasn't good enough. I didn't know I was in a tryout and uh, so I wanted to see like how I, how I did. Let's see how I did. Um, so I just wanted to uh, kind of like look at my performance and stuff and see uh, if this last match was as bad as I thought it was. Um, so let's go ahead and watch this to watch it together. Um, luckily for us, it was already recorded on the uh, on Twitch. So we're gonna watch it together, guys. Uh, oh, also they are like, what is this? This stream is literally people who don't want to play with GM. Oh, hold on, what? Uh, uh bruh, that's weird. All right, so what? What is this about? I try. There's like level 50 people who will play better oh dang i'm getting flamed <laughs> and take my advice uh hey i'll play with him this guy just told me i'm shit and i didn't understand his play style when he was 3 to 22 bro i never said i never once said a z for shit so i don't know where this line is coming from okay z showed me his build and i said and he wanted me to use a build and i said no i didn't want to use it because i thought my build was better and i said my build was my, my build was superior to the build that he showed about blossom and apparently he took that as a at a emotional level and he thought I was talking to him saying he was shit no I wasn't saying he was shit um so that line I don't know where it's coming from bro uh, and yes this is true um but I really wasn't counting like how many matches I play in the BCL uh casual uh standard queue I thought standard queue was casual, like it was just today I realized that it was actually a tryout queue thingy. So, if I knew it was a tryout, I won't have, uh, I won't have like play as a casual match. Like I would have actually like tried to like, uh, like play more DPS in a sense and like play more like seriously and stuff um also if if it is like a tryout like it's really important that you let people know that it is a tryout and stuff like that so people can uh actually try hard because it's a tryout and stuff and you can you should also let the captains know that it's a tryout so that the uh the guys who's who's being drafted for can actually get the role that he queue for so because many times i queue for like uh range dps I queue for melee DPS, but I don't end up getting range or melee DPS. And the guys who draw for me end up taking a uh, taking healer for me, and I end up playing a healer role. So that's that, right? So um, if you are making like a like a tryout thing, like you should let people know that it is a tryout, and then you should also let the captains know so that everybody can try their best in a match because it is a trial for somebody right um the way the uh, standard matches where it was pretty much like a casual casual match in my opinion i wasn't trying at all and it was really fun i'm not gonna lie like it was like the first time i actually played with uh like people a little bit above average like the average casual queue in a battle right where like they are like new players i'm actually playing with players who are not that new pretty much and it, it was it was a bit fun i'm not gonna lie it still felt a like casual match though but it was fun
and then the he said but he also he always on enemy team that's rice reaper i tried giving advice and helping he did try but again like when you are giving advice like don't give advice as if you want to change somebody right give advice like give your point like explain your point and like explain what you are saying and stuff it's up to the person to either take your advice or say dude i already know this and move on with whatever the person was doing right so if you are giving advice don't don't take it personally if the person don't want to use your advice or the person already know your advice they already heard it before and stuff like that so i mean these these are like some random stuff i didn't really expect this from zeef from uh uh dang i've been calling him zeef for so long i actually forgot his uh, from eerie uh and the one time he was on my team we still won damn is rob rice reaper trying to advocate for me or something i don't know rice you are that's uh ten thousand you are ten thousand times better okay zeef jesus christ zeef i never i never thought i could see this from you bro uh rice reaper positive gamer he he it's a it's a facade but i've been playing game i've been gaming uh well this week and then rice this week rice reaper this week so who is this guy i don't know this guy he's a moderator cake wait rice reaper well yes uh but i can't yesterday i i count yesterday okay i tell about it uh damn those key binds look crazy uh and playing with someone 40 percent win rate is manageable because like you win some you lose some and whatever but playing with someone uh who wins 10 percent of their game essentially means you auto lose if he on your team and I don't think anyone wants to, that's that's true dude like nobody will want like a 10% win rate uh, player on that team but I didn't know it was a tryout I didn't know it was a serious thing like I saw a standard and I thought casual match right and when I was invited like I could queue for it right I didn't like get any like any warning like dude like Nobody told me this, this, you should take this seriously because there is like a, a trial for you and stuff like that. I didn't, I didn't, because there was like a pro queue and then like a standard queue. So like when I saw a pro, I, I felt like, like that was like the league part of it. And then when I saw a standard, I thought that was the casual part of it. So I didn't know it was like a serious thing. And people were, again, people kept picking different roles for me and I really didn't mind. Um, I would have actually like tried to contact like one of the mods in a disco or whatever if they had them uh, To actually enforce like a rule that I actually got the role that I wanted so that I can actually try and try to win my matches and stuff But that wasn't the case uh, Yeah, kind of true uh, NG. I don't know what that means actually uh, Even 35% win rate uh if they're listening and don't think they are the best in the world is fine <laughs> uh jumong i actually think who the who they are matters i mean how they are matters more than win rate i would rather have a 25 percent uh win rate guy who has potential than a 50 50 year who reached their peak interesting but like if you are a 10 percent win rate and you are trying to improve that's fine everybody's trying to improve dude uh sleeper op zeef jumong almost passed alicia on win rate uh keck wait okay he passed red and nuts uh but some people think they can play jumong who is this guy talking about as in all cap too so this is like a furious thing right here but some people think they can play Juma <laughs> and 
and uh, something ate. Okay, I'm actually so angry. Oh God, I think that's why I got kicked. I mean, uh, I didn't get kicked. I actually left. Um. I mean, if I got kicked, it was going to be a bit too obvious if I got kicked, you know. But, you know, uh, I'm actually so angry. I guess this is me he's talking about. Uh, makes sense. I won all my Juma games lately. All two I had the past month. I won't name, I won't name that. Dude, he won't let go of this, though. I don't know who he's talking about, but he won't let go of it. Uh, start with six. Oh, that's, that's me, bro. That's me. <laughs> He's talking about me. Zeef, God, shit. I, I got about forty percent we were before. You thought about it then. Uh, Zeef six 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 Diablo. Uh, there's another guy named Diablo in that Discord. Uh, you really out that man. You really out in the man. Uh, WTF, dude. Not cool. This. This uh, 30 guy is, uh, I don't know if he belongs here. <laughs> I don't know if he's actually uh, supposed to be a moderator on this this on this on uh, channel. He's He got a different opinion compared to most of these guys. Uh, from what I'm seeing, I don't know if he's going to say something crazy later on. Uh, Zeef gifted Kappa face. Uh, adding cross to the listing. All right, so let's see what happened. I wonder if I should forward this. Let's forward this a little bit. Alright, go back to normal. So, this was a match here. And, uh, it's uh, Paloma, Jumong, and Crook versus Pestilus. I'm playing the Pestilus. Uh, Jade and Jamila. Alright, so I'm gonna pause this and say something. Um, this match, like, I didn't queue up to play healer. I actually queue up to play range. And the guy who was drafting for us, I told him that he was actually uh, play, um, uh, playing me dirty or something like that. And, you know, that didn't stop me from playing a range character, though, because they like this range in, and I said I, I, I didn't queue for, for healer, and they said, dude, you're going to play range. I mean, you're going to play a healer. And, again, I thought it was a casual match, so I really didn't care. Um, also, this is kind of toxic when you really think about it. Like, I queue for a range character, but, I, but somebody is making me play something else. That's, that's kind of toxic when you really think about it, so... Yeah, anyways, I end up playing a, a healer and let's see what how it goes out. Uh, it goes. Alright, so Jamila here, she played uh, outside of my my view and all that stuff, and she's too far up front. And I think I remember these rounds, right? Uh, well, the match that I remember, like the Jamila was like really, really far away from us. And I actually had to coach them and tell them, like these are like grand champion players pretty much. Um... And I'm not like trying to shit on them or, 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 or anything like that. But the, the difference between like a good Grandmaster player um, and like a bad player is pretty much like these guys, they will actually listen, right? When I say something like if if you haven't like gotten through, like, gotten under the influence of like uh, people like Zeef, I, like I just realized that Zeef doesn't really like me. 
Uh, so if you really hadn't like interacted with people like Zeef and stuff like that, and I gave you an advice, you will probably like end up following it and you will end up like winning a match with me, right? But if you actually encounter like people like Zeef and they already like told you something about me that isn't true, when I gave you an advice, you won't want to listen to me because like all of these negative stuff that Zeef been putting in your head. So you end up like getting a bad experience because that's what you were expecting uh when you were playing with me right so and that's something i cannot really change like it's how you think so i really can't change you like if you if you think i'm a bad player and i'm queuing so that you can lose a match and stuff like that and like no matter what i say to you like that that really can't change anything so it's really up to you to like change your own perspective and actually look at what i'm doing and you know make your own result out of that but if you've been influenced by people like Zeef, who like pretend to be nice, but are actually going behind my back and saying stuff like this, like it's not really cool, dude. Like you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't like call me goat, greater, great of all, greatest of all time and stuff like that. Like like the, the goat and all that stuff, pog and all that stuff, and then come behind my back and say shit like this, bro. It's not cool at all. Anyways, so I told his, I told uh, Jamila uh, what she's supposed to be doing, and she listing and in this match we actually re reverse swept these guys, and uh, I think this pissed Zeef off even more, and that's why I got uh, pretty much got banned from the standard queue. I guess, uh, what, what else are they saying? I think he's a poker. Who are they talking about? Cross? Who is, oh yeah, Cross. Um, I think this is the Jumong that is playing Cross. I mean, the Cross that is playing Jumong right now. And they're probably thinking about kicking him too. Nah, he's doing fine. Uh, damn, Jumong really countered Jamila. Uh, Jumong countered all melee pretty much. You just gotta know how to play him. Uh, Kek, wait. Okay, so Jamal goes in, gets some decent damage in there. Got double panic, triple panic. I mean, a uh, quad panic, quadrado, whatever. Right, my allies getting sweeped here, getting swept. been talking more trash about me so let's pause and read some more trash uh of course I'm gonna scroll down to read them already they ain't even say anything yet 
All right, so at this point, as you guys can see, we won one match. These guys are taking away like three rounds in a row. I got, I got caught over there and I got destroyed. I don't know why. Uh, click it and reload. Jesus Christ. Whoa, what happened? Something weird happened on my internet. Uh, dun, dun. Connection fill, baby. So like for those of you guys who are like following these people and looking up to people like just keep in mind that the people you are looking up to sometimes I try to like keep you down uh, because they are afraid that you might get better than dumb and stuff like that so um i don't know i just saw z like as a cool person um i know like i don't know like previous discord i think like the first discord um i tried to join but there was like a like a weird stuff like i don't know like a supremacist type of thing going on in that discord so i had to leave and i thought z was z was like the only person who didn't have that type of personality that type of mindset but apparently i was wrong so again i'm back to the solo <laughs> to the solo lifestyle um anyways that's all i want to say i don't want to drag this on for too long but you know a lot of people are out there uh getting the wrong information about me and uh getting the wrong perspective about me and i'm not no i'm not i don't know about this so i'm just hanging out doing my casual stuff so when these people like look at what i'm doing casually um like they see it how it is and they're like man like this is this might actually be true and stuff like that right and like I don't know. I can't really change you guys. Like, I don't, I can't really change you. It's really up to you, right? Uh, if you're going to like keep the opinion that you have about me, like, if you're going to keep it or if you're going to drop it or whatever, it's really up to you. And I, I really don't mind. Uh, whatever you think is yours. Like, as you guys know me, like, I'm like the chillest person in, in this entire community. And I really don't mind whatever people think or say. Uh, because, you know, I just, I just do my my stuff, you know. Like I stream to like one viewer or whatever, and I don't really mind because when I'm streaming, I'm really thinking about like being in that frame of mind where like I feel like somebody is watching, 
or like I'm recording so I have to like you know just entertain or like uh, you know try to just play a little bit professionally or like uh, I mean sometimes when I stream I don't I don't like go all in and stuff like that but you know I try to make my my, my video as uh, as fun as possible because when I'm streaming it's really for me it's not really for like I don't know it's it's kind of it's kind of uh, weird to say this but I, when I'm streaming, I, it's really up to me. Like, if I really want to like get views and stuff, I will like stream stuff that people want to like watch, right? Um, if you want to get views, you stream stuff like a uh, new world. You stream stuff like a uh, mobile legend and stuff like that. Like, and you put clickbait titles on them. Like, you get a lot of views and stuff like that. But that's not me, right? So, again, uh, it just is what it is. Uh, so what else um as for my discord channel right um i know like a lot of people want to like uh i don't know a lot of people want i don't know i don't know if anybody still cares cares about battle right right now like yeah so battle right uh my discord the reason why i can't really uh keep on making that discord bot it's because like from the looks of it like i look at the overall thing um of the game the overall future of the game and stuff and when i looked at it like i realized that i really wasn't gonna make any impact like i wasn't gonna change the fact that this game is uh it's not gonna get any attention from the de developer right i really wasn't gonna change that unless the developer themselves decide to like improve the game and actually make it fun which is something that is not on our table right now because they are v rising and it's making them a lot of money so um you know that's just how it is right um again if it ain't broke you you don't you don't have to fix it and stuff and uh yeah so i'm not i'm not really gonna like suffer myself uh trying to make like trying to draw people to something that isn't going anywhere right um i don't I, i'm not going to to suffer my uh, i'm not going to struggle because the developers are not really going to like help uh to you know uh bring more players into the game they are already done with what they, what they wanted to do and i don't blame them so i'm not going to like you know I'm not going to push it any further. Like, this is what they want for the game. So, that's how it's going to be, right? Um, take it how you, how you will, right? Um, it's just, like, you have your own time. And where you put it is really up to you. And in my case, I don't really think it's, it is, uh, this game is worth like put me putting him that extra time to like work on a on a buy like like that's that's too much right that's like too much i can stream the your game i can record and stuff but i'm not gonna like put in that extra effort and stuff so um that's what i did for ben saying there um the bot is still there um they, i still have the code the, the uh code base for that and all that stuff the database and everything for that bot um I don't know if you want to like if you want to to get this uh if you want to like make uh a discord like server and stuff like that uh with the code that I have and stuff if you want that code for free or whatever I can still give it out um or if you want me to continue working on it you're gonna have to like probably like fork over some money or whatever uh but I'm not really gonna do that for free and stuff so um yeah anyways this is this is it guys um i'm gonna like just continue like streaming once in a while um you know yeah i'm actually a little bit busy so once in a while when i can uh, i haven't really given up on this game uh but i'm i'm a little bit busy so once in a while uh so yeah guys tony into my next stream or whatever and i'll see you guys later and all, all of you guys out there uh hating on uh on gms or whatever uh you gotta stop the hate bro like 
the game is already there like you don't want to like you know like we had like the few people left you don't want to like kill us off too man like come on like it's not like you guys are going to push me away from this game like if i want to play i'll play like, i don't i don't really care um but anyways like stop the toxicity like the community is really small like stop being girls like see the little gossip and stuff like uh folk tales and all that stuff stop it that's what females do you you guys are men like you shouldn't be doing that stuff that's like very petty and petty is like a term that you shouldn't be using on a guy so for all of you guys out there like being petty and stuff like stop that man like it's a game like if you lost to me like really horribly in the past and that really got to you like all you have to do is improve and try to get back at me that way right try to like you know win against me the next time like don't take it as a grudge against me when you're on my side and like try to play bad so that i can lose and stuff or you go to other channels and like try to like talk tra uh, trash about me behind my back and if you bring your bill to me and you try to like make me have your bill and like use it for some reason and i said no again like with me like when i'm saying no it's not like i hate you or whatever right like it's just my personality like i'm really honest if i see something and i don't like it i would say it right so uh it's just how it is like sometimes i do it like i don't even know like i just do it like if i see a bill and it's like to me it's like trash i'll say bro like that bill is trash like <laughs> and don't take it personally like you should probably like ask me like why I think it's a trash and I'm I'm definitely going to like explain it like exactly how I see it and stuff and like again like your bill is yours right and my bill is mine and the way you play it is 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 completely different from how I I view it so if I say your bill is trash like don't feel bad about it because I haven't seen you play it like the right way and stuff I haven't seen you like apply all the rights in it and stuff like that so you should you should take it that way and really don't like feel bad about it um and if you want to like prove that your bill is good like show me show me like your bill in action and stuff and you know that would be cool and also if you have your bill like keep it to yourself like unless somebody come to you and like ask you to like hey man like teach me how to play like show me your bills and like i want to learn how to like build this my character the same way that you did and stuff like you can show your bill to other people but don't expect them to like copy your bill as if it's like the best bill in the world or, or if it's like uh a meta thing or whatever because meta itself developed by like people actually wanting to to copy the bill and stuff like that you can like invite people to your private discord and like force them to like use your bill because you know you think your bill is is better and stuff like that and like try to force people into that box like that's not how life works um uh, i know a lot of people like copy and like you know a lot of people don't have that strong of a will to like go their own way and stuff but like that definitely exclude me because like i'm not gonna like look at your bill and copy it just because um of copying sake right if i th if i think your bill is not going to be effective with how i play right i'm not going to copy it right um again like if you think i'm a bad player it's really up to you like i really can't change you otherwise like i really can't say i'm a good player when you actually are out there thinking that i'm a bad player like i can't really change that right it's really up to you um to like judge on your own on your own behalf and stuff like that right so um again watch watch my streams and stuff um you know and i'm open to like discussing bill um building stuff like again when i'm discussing bill with you i'm gonna be honest so if you are bringing your bill to me you should make sure that you have a really strong skin because i'm not gonna hold back uh again i'm not holding i'm not gonna hold back because I respect you and I want you to like see my perspective and I want to be honest to you about whatever um, you are talking about and stuff like that. I'm not going to be fake. I'm not going to, to come in front of you and like look at your bill and I think it's bad but then I tell you that it is good and then I go behind your back and talk trash about your bill behind your back, right? That's not me, right? So 
if you want that you can go to people who are like who would be nice to you like Zeef and stuff and go behind your back and talk shit about you like he's doing with me right now and it's really surprising it's like mind blowing like i was completely wrong uh so yeah i'll see you guys later peace out